rolling into uh, Bisbee Suite. We are having breakfast at La Veranda, and we're actually sitting out on the open deck in the rear of La Veranda. And here we are pulling into port. Morning, Nick. Valentine, how are you this morning? How are you doing? Good. 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 How are you doing? Yeah, fantastic. I'm coming to you in 25 minutes. Okay. 25, 25 minutes? minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Twenty-five seconds. Twenty-five seconds. Countdown. I think this is our first time eating out on the deck of the veranda on any of the ships. I don't know why we've never done it before. Nope. Nick, Mr. how's it going, Nick? Good morning, Mr. Valentine. This is Nicholas, all the way from South Africa, greeting you with a lovely good morning. Good morning, Nick. <laughs> On board the Region 7 Seas. Okay. <laughs> okay, I've got some scrambled eggs. They're hash browns. Sorry, they're corned beef hash, which is really, really good. Some bacon, potatoes, and a croissant. Janetta has the corned beef hash, potatoes, sausage, an omelet, some toast, and some muesli. That's a lot of food. Yeah, that is a lot of food. Carol, I'm from Boston. Carol from Boston? Yeah. Hey, Pat from Boston. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Today we're going off on our own. This is the port of Visby, and we're going to be catching the Regent Supplied Shuttle over to the Old Town.
Kaniska Tradgard. That's how I'm going to say it. This is Schnockish Porton. In my younger days, I would have climbed that. But I am not even going to do this today. Tonight for dinner, we're heading down to Chartreuse. The ship is only half full, so we were able to get a second reservation for both Chartreuse and Prime 7. So we're doing Chartreuse tonight. A couple of nights from now, we'll be at Prime 7. And then two nights after that, we'll be at Prime 7 again. Yeah. Okay, we have the normal selection of bread. I think he said sourdough. Sourdough. Baguette. And wheat. Let's just go with that. Mm -hmm. But the butters are what's different. There's one that's a mushroom butter, and the other that's seaweed butter. So we'll be uh, looking to try those out. And your name is? Anak? Anak. Yeah. Okay, Anak. And where are you from? I'm from Bali, Madam. Bali? Ba yeah. oh. oh. We haven't been there. Far away. You haven't been there? No, we haven't. We have not. Come to Bali. I grab, I grab you. Come to Bali. <laughs> <laughs> Very nice, huh? Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, we've been looking at videos of Bali. Mm -hmm. Some of the resorts there look just beautiful. Yes. Yeah, Come yeah. Well, we're looking forward to March? Uh, yeah, this is special there in Bali. Okay. We did a silent day because we did everybody will shut down for one for 24 hours. No light, no internet. <laughs> for one day. Uh -huh. And so you just relax. Yes, relax. Feel like how is it the special uh, nature? Okay. We just shared about the bird is just singing. Mm -hmm. Everything. Beautiful. The nature. Okay. Yeah. We'll look forward to it, yep. For sure. Maybe we'll get For there sure. soon. You can take a video. All right. Okay. And where are you from, Jigal? Is it? Where are you from? Uh, actually, I'm from uh, Mauritius. I'm living in Mauritius. Mauritius, but, that's right, okay. Yeah. Uh, but I'm born and they go for school and everything. I'm from Sri Lanka. Oh, oh that's okay. right, Sri Lanka. Sri Lanka. Yes, from Sri Lanka. Okay, great. Yes, great. Thank you. And happy to see you. Thank you very much. <laughs> so, Mrs. Valentine, you're having the escargot. So, the escargot is being cooked in garlic and butter, served in a herb puree, which is watercress and parsley. And garlic is an anchovy pomery cream and some rustic crouton on the top. And in the middle, you will get the braised rutabaga. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. <laughs> and for you, sir, we have yes. the balik salmon for you with a trio of lenis, Normandy cream, and a calamansi. Thank you very much. Thank you. Bon appetit. Thank you. So that's the salmon. So that's like sushi, maybe? No, no, no. I thought it was going to be smoked salmon, though. Yes. I'm going to give you the spoon. It is smoked salmon, though. It is? Mm -hmm. It's good. How's that? Doesn't really work for you? No, it has a really 
Um, the broth, I'm not really crazy about. The um, smells are good. Yeah, you're not going to eat much anyway. Yeah. The broth has this like bite to it. Mm -hmm. so. Or you go. Just go ahead. I'll, I'll put my fork in. Mm. Right, that out. The way it goes. You can't get much of it with your fork. I said it wasn't good. I don't want to have too much of it. Yeah, I don't like that. Either. Yeah, I don't like their bra. <laughs> okay, so my, my salmon is good. Uh, we, don't, we don't care for Janetta's escargot. Yeah. The snails themselves, okay, the, the broth is not good. Yeah. She's not crazy I'm about not it. crazy about the broth. <laughs> I do like the snails, of course, but <laughs> not the broth. For something else, um, you want some of the frog broth? Yeah, the frog broth, please. Thank okay. you. Should I leave you this one? Or yeah, I'm just going to eat the snails out of it, yeah. <laughs> Okay, so Janetta's, Janetta's gonna substitute in the foie gras. I always love foie gras. <laughs> yeah, that, that sauce. You didn't yeah. like it either, huh? No. I don't know what gives it that, that bitter, it has some sort of bitter thing. So there was nothing wrong with the preparation. It's just something that we don't like. That, yeah. What is this called? That one is called Piuse Classico for the sweet wine. Okay. Ah. It's good for your dessert or foie gras. Okay. Do you have foie gras, madam? Yes, ah, yes, why. yes, yes, good yes, choice. that's why. Thank you. Right, thank you, Anna. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Since Shanetta didn't like the escargot preparation, she has gone back to her old standby, the foie gras. Yes, I'm a horrible person. She is. She's a horrible person. <laughs> but I don't care. It tastes good. <laughs> Are you filming me? You haven't put anything in your mouth yet. You just have to eat it and say, mmm, it's good. Mmm, it's good. That's okay. <laughs> all you need to do. See? Alright, now I decided to have myself a martini while I'm waiting for my food. Is that straight up with three olives? What do you call that? Straight up with three olives. Having the truck of lamb with a mm -hmm. rosemary bessia, chickpea yeah. frita, and a sherry veal sauce. Ah. Okay. Yes, I see it. Yes, I see it. you. You have the beef rossini with a brioche bread, mushroom royale, seared foie gras. Very good in sauce and some parsley puree. Great, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. I just missed all. Okay, so this. Mm. Really good. Excellent. Excellent. This is prepared Ooh, perfectly. I don't know if they didn't cheapen out. I just don't think they were. They're really ready trained, yeah. Yeah. Chef's one is good because this is a. I mean, look at look how thick this is. It is. Compared to what I what we got on. Um, yeah, the quality of the meat is different too. Yeah. It could have been a you know just after COVID thing. Yeah. But still, that's why I started looking at other cruises. I said, like, ah, you know, maybe we try something else. It wasn't that great that I should feel any loyalty. Not that I feel any loyalty anyway, but. <laughs> mm. How's yours? Terrific. I love it. Very cook, good. Cooked the right way? Mm hmm. Exactly as I asked it to be cooked. I like my lamb a little bit more on the the rare side, and they did it perfectly. And so I'm I'm very pleased. Good. Right. Mm -hmm. Camera goes down. 
and we eat. <laughs> mm. It's very good. Mm. Mm. I like it. After dinner, we had drinks with a nice couple from Atlanta. Sorry, but I forgot their names. Tomorrow, we'll be heading into Klaipeda, Lithuania. We'll see you there.